there's a tree that fell. So, that's what we're doing. And he's disking, and that's a good sign. That's not our luck. <laughs> oh, let me show you though. I did this. Look at all that. Oh, wow. This morning. Yeah. Uh, there was a little baby deer running through the woods. Um, I guess you would call that a fawn. Yeah. He's put in, been putting some hay in this lot. This is a group of cows and calves still. Uh, trying to get them to come in here so we can get them all caught. We are, we are way behind on separating mamas and calves and weaning. So, that is what we will be doing very shortly. Um, we got to get these calves off these mamas. And then keep feeding the calves a little bit till we figure out the best time to sell. So, that's what we're doing. Oh, yeah, good. There's a tree that fell. Luckily, it fell away from the building, and it was on this side of the fence. So, yeah. Just something to get cut up, that's all. Huh. Wow. This, um, this one was wobbly. He's got to tighten it. Got the water. Got to head out. We'll go check on him later. He asked if I was going to bring him lunch. Yes, I will take him lunch and we will go see what's going on down there in the bottom. Yeah. Let me go see what the children are doing. They need to get up and get going. It's a brand new day. Even if it is going to be hot. Also, I'm pretty sure if I just sat here, I could watch the crabgrass. And the weeds grow. Yeah. Oh, looky, y'all. We have yellow lines. They just got put on. I guess that means they're done. Yay. More woods. More creeks to cross. There's one right up here. Like I said in the last video, I think this is some land that, um, there's a creek way down there that we used to, we used to farm, well, excuse me, we used to cut hay on for a previous landowner, and now this landowner 
is letting us do the same. We haven't we haven't cut it in many years. Um, there was corn on it for a few years from a local dairyman. It got flooded several times. Um, he's since gone out of business. So anyway, we're trying to trying to make it usable and like we said in that last video, there's some other guys down here doing some ditching. Yeah, they're all out here doing some work. So trying to trying to improve the land and make it a little more usable for us and for the landowner. So here we go. And there he is. And he's disking and that's a good sign. And there's somebody over there ditching and somebody over there ditching. <laughs> Lots going on right here. And so the river, the Dan River, is just on the other side of those trees. Best I remember there's about, there's one, two, three, four, like five separate fields down here. Some definitely larger than others. And the ditching, I'm sure, is for water control because it just gets really wet down here in some spots. And so, anyway, this is good. This is good stuff happening. There's even more equipment down here than I realized. Uh, I don't know what those things are called. Is that a track hoe? I think maybe it's a track hoe. And a back home. <laughs> Maybe. He said that uh, the tractor, our 4440 there, that it has a little bit of a hard time with the first pass with the disc it's so heavy but he said once it's going back over land that it's already dissed once it's easier to pull he said he really needs weights on the tractor but he didn't put them on so What was it that broke this morning? What was it that broke? Turnbuckle on a wing. Turnbuckle on a wing. You got it fixed okay. Well, I bought a new turnbuckle, buddy. <laughs> bought a new one. Okay. Woo. So they are ditching just to help water flow down here. That's right. That's right. Okay. There's a lot going on. Are those two over there called track hose and that's a back hose? No, that's a bulldog. Oh. <laughs> It's a bulldozer. Okay. What are those other ones? Track eyes? Yeah. Yeah. I don't know. All the terms. Back over oh. Nothing breaks down. Yeah. Again. off there's really not anything exciting to show he's just disking and those guys are just digging <laughs> Lord said they're not new ditches they're ditches they're reworking old ditches that have gotten like filled in and stuff so anyway he said all together it's about 50 55 acres and he said he should should be able to disc 50 acres in a day but 
that's barring nothing breaks down and we know that that's not our luck. <laughs> so I don't know. He wants to go over it all several times. So he's gonna be down here for several days, I believe. And I believe I am now going home to take the kids and we're going to find a water hole because it's very hot and it just seems like a good idea. So that's what we're doing. This is some of that corn he replanted over barley that was cut. It's coming up, looking pretty good, I reckon. I was wrong, thought they were done, but guess what? I'm gonna get off right here, cause I can. Oh, they're putting the white line in, gotcha. Yeah, let's do that so we don't get it all over our dirty old truck. <laughs> okay, well, went to the Dollar General looking for a raft for me, and that was the only thing I could find that uh, would fit an adult. So, I'm about to be in the river in a unicorn, and I'm not mad about it. What do you think, buddy? <laughs> well, I'm about to be in the river in a baby boat. Yeah, you got a baby boat. <laughs> Seriously though, this is what we're doing. Happy summer! Well, I was out there for a little while. I decided to get out for a minute, but <laughs> the unicorn is working. The unicorn is working fine. <laughs> it's another nice day down here. It's a beautiful morning from the porch. Favorite time of day. Everything's waking up. The birds are singing. The light through those trees is perfect. Yeah, it's gonna be a good day. Going to look for some cows. When the kids and I were uh, down here yesterday, we didn't see the cows anywhere <laughs> so we want to make sure that they are in fact still in the pasture so we are um we're going to look well we haven't found them yet but we saw some signs some fresh piles uh they have eaten this down pretty good the sorghum that we had left so we're closing the gate on them. We're gonna let this do its thing so we can cut it again for hay. Hoping they're down on the river somewhere. Found some of them yeah. where the kids and I were yesterday. <laughs> it's not many though. It's definitely not all of them. Uh. Down towards the water. Huh. We saw more of them on the way out, so that's good. Did just notice that the mineral feeder broke. Not the strap, the actual feeder. We gotta fix that. He did get everything. He got over all that land yesterday with a tiller, so he's with a tiller, <laughs> with a disc. So He's going back today to go over it again. He wants to go over it about three times. So that's what he'll be doing. Me and the kids are gonna try to stay cool again. This corn's looking pretty good. Anything you wanna say this morning? You haven't said much lately. Spray some corn. Get time to do it. Need to spray some. This was just sprayed, wasn't it? I won't spray. I sprayed it for a Oh. You mean you need to spray it for weeds yeah. or nitrogen? Weeds and grass. Mm. Another week. 
running with. Yeah, how much rain? And what do we get? Six tenths two days ago. It didn't rain yesterday, did it? We got four tenths two days ago. Four tenths. Okay. We're in a pattern of 90s and possible thunderstorms every day for the foreseeable future and the unforeseeable future. <laughs> uh, summertime in the south. Well, we are just getting back. Huh? Oh. Okay. We are just getting home from church. Stopped and got the kids a little Mickey D's. While I was in the, uh, while I was in the line, a vehicle behind me, a truck, ran into me. They bumped me. Uh, they did not acknowledge it. I did not acknowledge it. I knew that it couldn't hurt this truck. I did see where their little front license plate was now a, now a V. They're just lucky they hit me and not somebody else that wanted to, to, to sue or scream whiplash or whatever. But, anywho, it's all good. They said my truck is fine. Um, so, just met Lawrence heading out on the tractor. <laughs> oh, he said he had to come home because an axle was loose. That's not good. He said he got it tightened and he's heading back. Maybe maybe he'll, he'll be able to finish disking that those fields before something just absolutely falls apart to the point that it can't be used anymore <laughs> i don't know okay it's another very hot day oh 93 it's hot it's hot i am actually going to have some crib time today because i have a presentation to give tuesday morning very early and i need to finish it so anyway that's what we're doing today. Not much farming here from me or the children. It's too hot. Just other stuff. So I'll take you to the crib with me. Somebody said they wanted to see more of the crib. It's a really short tour. It's a really short tour, but I'll show it again. Talk about it a little more maybe. Okay. Okay. Bonnie and I are heading to the crib to do a little quiet work. Kids are playing in their rooms. Yes, they're playing video games. Well, talking to friends, playing games. It's too hot to be outside right now. So, anyway, that's what we're doing. So, if you're new here, this is my, what I call my crib. It was an old corn crib that a genius of a man and friend <laughs> uh, put, made new, new on the outside and kept it looking the same on the, I mean, new on the inside and well, there's a new roof and just made it, allowed it to keep its character on the outside. Even the old door, got to keep the old door and added a new door. Come on, Bonnie, you going in? Bonnie. There you are. You going in with me? Oh, let me show you though. I did this. I installed a state-of-the-art patio and walkway because it was so muddy. Do you like that? I mean, I was pretty proud of it. Found in scrap pile. <laughs> this will not be permanent. But it sure does work for now. We still got to get steps. We're thinking about using railroad ties. It's just a matter of getting them and doing that. I think that'll match really well. So, anywho, here we are. My hands are full. <laughs> Come on, buddy. Ooh, and it feels good in here because we have AC. A little mini split. AC and heat unit. Bonnie. Come on, baby. Do you not want to come in? Bonnie. Come on, baby. Yeah. Bonnie. Bonnie has a bed. She'll probably lay on the floor, though, because it's cool. Yeah, so this is it. We have 
lights that dim. Hold on, wait for it. Woo, look at that. Fancy, fancy. And uh, some hand-me-down furniture. Beautiful, just did a beautiful job. I love it, seriously. Can't put in words how much I love it. Never, ever, ever, never dreamed that I would have something this nice here. Oh my gosh, but I sure do love it. And now I'm gonna sit at my little desk. I usually sit in the chair, the leather chair, but I actually wanna sit at the desk. I'm gonna sit at the desk and focus and get my work done and be able to look out at the woods. Is that where you're staying? 10-4? With mommy? You happy? Yeah. Bought me a little office chair. Yeah. And this desk is just the right size for my laptop. Um, I don't have internet out here yet. I actually have found that it will pick up a little bit from my house. And I've ordered an antenna that's supposed to shoot it supposed to shoot the Wi-Fi from the house to here. It should come this week. Let's hope that works. Cause yeah, it was picking up two bars, two whole bars, y'all. I was able to like check email out here the other day, which was amazing. So anyway, it's not working right now, but it doesn't matter. I don't need it for what I'm doing. Okay, here we go. Did you find your bed? You found your bed. <laughs> you ready to go in? <laughs> I'll take that as a yes. Okay, let's see. That's right, shake all that fur all over my floor. <laughs> Are you eating potato chips and laying on a register? I served Lawrence a very fancy meal tonight. It was good though, wasn't it? <laughs> Come on. You have eaten the crew. Hmm? You black as the crew. You black as the crew. You have eaten the crew. Hmm? Say. We were just yeah. talking about eating crow. So I eat anything. <laughs> I'd probably eat old crew. Yes, I would. <laughs> she I'd probably, probably eat would. old crew. He oh. holds still long enough. How about you, Gus? How about you, Gus? Mm. Get up here. All Get the, up here. All the babies with their dad. Y'all mm -hmm. are definitely rotten. You're rotten. Mm -hmm. Yeah. We love our daddy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Sorry, there's no food. It's all gone. <clears throat> all right, so you got it over one more time, and you're going to let it sit. Yeah, it's just for a few days. Maybe some of that solid die. It's real working solid. <clears throat> and then you're going to go back and work some of it. Yeah, some of it is soft enough I can run it. Man, I'm going to it. It'll be all right. Okay, well, bye. bye. <laughs> He's ready to go sit down in his chair. It's 8 12. It's time. He's earned a seat. No, we didn't go to the river. I went to the crib. Oh. That's a pretty sunset. Oh, wow. Okay, I'm glad I came down here to get this. This looks totally different than yesterday. Wow, they got rid of all the brush and stuff. Oh, nice. <laughs> it's still, this is still the only place across. Right here? Yeah. Yeah. 
Unless you can fly. You have the smartest mouth sometimes. Get that all the way up and then the file field just get uh, wow. right up and look at that. Can. On this side? Yeah. Right okay, there. I got it. So, we did all the stitching. And then there's a field over there. And then on the other side of those trees is our river bottom where we, we had beans and the corn that got flooded. So, it all just ties together down the river here. Looks good. Woo! It's a lot of ground. It's a lot of dirt. Now I got my school back to the field. Okay. You want me to go all the way to the end? And there's the last field and the last stitch. I know. Oh, back up in the hole? Yeah. Um, and our beans are back there in the dark. Bats up there. Fireflies everywhere. Lightning bugs. I actually call them lightning bugs. What do you call them? Lightning bug. Lightning bug, yeah. I don't even know why I said firefly. Some people call them that. Thank you. You're welcome. This Uber ride is over. Alrighty. Homeward bound now, for for sure, for good. <laughs> Forgot he needed to come back and get a tractor. What's he doing? I'm gonna make sure he gets out of here. I don't know how he pulls that thing up this tight path. But obviously he does. Better him than me. Bunny. I miss the bunny rabbit. I always miss all the things on the video. I thought maybe he'd be stopping up here. That's why I waited on him. Because I forgot to ask. You glad I waited on you? Yeah. <laughs> I forgot to ask if you needed a ride, if you were coming to the house. John done some pulling. The sound of summer. It feels like summer too. <laughs> He's asking the dogs if they want to go outside. Are you barking at me? Oh, am I a booger? Am I the booger man? No, I'm not. You silly boy. 